So is there a name you're comfortable giving us? Delta. Hi, Delta. Can, can you tell us, um, were you here last night at Occupy SF and what happened? I was. I was actually shouting out, out, out at the cops. They came in and took the bridge in front of the bank over there. Can you tell us what the bridge is? The bridge is, uh, we bri bridge the gap between the 101 for the Federal Reserve and uh, Justin Herman Plaza. They were trying to occupy the middle there for, you know, bridge the gap type thing. So. And uh, so the cops came in um, last night at about what time? Uh, well, that must have been around 3 o'clock, somewhere between 3 and 4. And what did they do? They came in, took down 15 tanks, put up the barricades. And I was out there, and I was pointing out a bunch of facts to them, saying, Hey, you guys have kids, too. We're fighting for your pension. I had cops in tears. I had cops talking amongst themselves and listening to me. They were watching me, listening to every word I said. Then I had someone, like an undercover, who just talked to the police chief, trying to get my attention, target me, and had to pull me over there to talk with them and try and tell me that if we go back over there, they'll leave us alone. They don't want to be here. Let's go back to doing your thing. And ultimately, trying to get me to be silenced and I told them you know I made the announcement and then I turned around and right after I made that announcement and told them we will not be fooled neither. We will stay, we all forces will go stronger. Raid us, it helps us. Every time you raid our numbers our numbers double, they're triple. We have Occupy Cali coming here today on the 15th or 16th, sorry, because today's on the 16th. And our forces are only gonna be that much more stronger. Tell me what Occupy Cali is. It's for the it's where all the Occupy within Cali kind of come here and march, rally, you know, and discuss everything, kind of work everyone out, work it, try and fix everything, work everything out, talk about plans for all the Occupies, etc., trying to help make it out. So it's kind of a coordination group for all the Occupies in California. Coordination groups. Um, there's yes, I agree. Coordination. Groups. All Occupies in California and every city, Berkeley, Oakland, etc. They're coming here to help try and discuss. You know, San Francisco is our beacon of hope. If everything, you know, Oakland went down, we went back over there. You know, they cleared out, we go, our numbers double. Occupy SF is a weak beacon of hope for the simple fact we ha we don't show violence back to them. Right. We show non-resistance. The more they fuck us up, the more they hurt us, the more they try and attack innocent people and continue to injure veterans. Who knows, they could kill a guy if they hit him in the temple with a tear gas canister, you know? I brought that up to their attention last night, so it's just, you know, it's got good. They're, I'm messing with them. I'm talking, getting through the individuals and the police force. Did you see any arrests last night? Uh, they arrested a 60-year-old woman last night who was sleeping. Yeah. And um, were there any injuries? Yes, there were. There was some lady who was trying to get her stuff back, and a cop took her, slammed her against the fence, yeah. and, so, and they were physically abusing people. There was brutality last night. Uh, just for approaching a cop, just for walking past, they were attacking people. They bumped some dude on the head, and he had blood gushing. How much of this did you see personally? I saw, I saw the 80 or 60 year old woman get arrested, saw the dude with the blood, I only I saw him when he was patched up, um, I was out there shouting at all of them, I had, I know I counted cops and tears, so. What's your message to people who aren't sure about Occupy and what it means? If you're not sure about Occupy, if the message ain't clear yet, come on down, experience it. Anyone can say anything. Why don't you come down and find for yourself? What about um, libertarians? Libertarians. I'm not a libertarian, but libertarians are conservatives who uh, often say uh, that Occupy is all about the left wing and, and nobody else is welcome. Are they right or wrong? We're all equal, so technically for them to label us is wrong because we're all humans, we're, we are the 99%. Every single time someone has been fucked over by our government, every single time our government sends our soldiers over to the war, over to war, and then when they come back injured and all fucked up from it, refuse to help, refuse to aid them. That's why we're, that's one of the reasons we're here, you know, is we're tired, we're fighting for humanity. 
We're fighting for our right to exist. We're fighting for e e equality. We don't want money. Money is shunned. No, no, we need a system. We've tried our government systems for thousands of years, and every single time it fails. Mankind, but the beauty of mankind is it always has a beautiful thing about it. it comes together and puts aside its petty differences for a common enemy or for a common goal, for even for a common aspiration or a common hope. And that's it's a beautiful thing. So, you know, come join us. Okay, thank you very much.